Hi everyone. This is my first lecture on uh, Django. Today I will be covering how to install Django. First of all, you should know what is Django. Django is a high-level Python web framework that embraces the development and the clean design of a website. It is obviously it's free and open source. And it's fast, secure, scalable, and it's a lot of advantages available. If you want to know more advantages about it, then you can just Google it. Another one of the best advantages, like the back end and front end, can be easily accessible. That's one of the best things. It's available with the Python and it can be edited easily. So today I will be covering up uh, how to install Django using two methods. One is using the PowerShell, another one is using the CMD. To using the PowerShell, you just search uh, PowerShell in your search bar, then open the PowerShell with the uh, administrator rights. Once it is done, so then just follow the codes. If you are using the Linux built operating system, then just type sudo sudo before every instruction which I am following and the instructions are same just you should mention the sudo that's it sudo then the, uh, the instruction which I am giving just you should follow it otherwise if you are using windows as uh, I am doing just follow the same thing in all the version windows 7, 8 everything first of all the main thing you should have the python available for installing Django to check whether the python is available you can mention python then hyphen version if Python is not available, don't worry, just uh, go to the Python website python.org slash downloads and download the latest one. Try to download the latest one, it will be more uh, easy for you. Once it is done, then while installing, just follow the instructions already available inside the folder and uh, while installing, just specify the path, it will be more easy for you. The thing is that uh, the Django is available on our cloud. To make the Django from cloud to our local server in computer, then you should have the tool for that one to download it from there. Using there are two tools: one is easy, easily easy install, and another one is the pip. Easy install can be easily used on the PowerShell, and the pip is for the CMD. We can say, which as per my concern. If you are using easy install for that one, also first whether the easy install we should know whether the easy install is available or not for that one. Just type ec install ec underscore install then hyphen version to hyphen hyphen the version. If it is available, it will be shown the version number. If not, then skip the video forward. If not available, skip the video forward and see it try to install the Django with the help of CMD. If it is available, then continue by installing by typing ec install uh, Django equal to equal to the version number we can mention the version number is 1.10 it's more it's the latest one i guess just you can install it it if it is available it will be downloading the a file from the cloud and once it is done then skip the entire video if it's successfully installed skip the entire video and go to the second my second video of mine in that it is shown how to create a project using jam if not, then continue the video. I'll be showing how to install using CM, how to install the Django using CMD, and it will be more easy. Let us see how to install Django with the help of CMD. First of all, for installing Django using CMD, you should open CMD with the administrator rights. Then you should remember you should have the Python pre installed on your this one. I have already shown how to install the uh, Python. Then if uh, pip is the tool which is used for installing django in our cmd so you can use pip install django in my case the django is already available showing that it's already available if no in your case it will not shown like this it will be installing once the downloading is done you can if it is successfully downloaded you can continue the second video of mine it is showing how to create a project using django